hello hello today i'm coming to you guys live from my closet this is going to be probably one of the quickest videos i have posted on my channel and i know i haven't posted in a while i'm going to start back posting um but anyways i look rough so please don't say anything about it um i'm hurrying to try to get out of town for my husband's birthday we're celebrating this weekend and i just wanted to do an unboxing with you guys so today i am going to be showing you guys my new christian louboutin luby girl and i got these from the christian louboutin boutique in atlanta georgia they come packaged just like this um before i open the box i'm going to show you what came in the bag so the first thing i have the first thing I have is the authentication card or the certificate of authenticity. Um, and this says right here, love your red soles. Please note that all shoes must be tried on on carpet. Our soles are very delicate and we cannot accept returns on shoes that appear to be worn or damaged. Return shoes, returning shoes where the soles appear worn may result in a fee or be returned to you. Thank you for understanding. So that's that. And then it just comes with um, like your bill of sale and everything like that. And the receipt stapled to the thing, um, stapled to the card. So I'm going to put that back. The next thing I have are these, um, these little uh, ankle protectors that they gave me. This is actually not for this pair that I bought. This is for my Eriza, which I will be doing a separate video on. Um, but they gave me these for free and they gave me these, um, these foot cushions for free as well. Now for as much as I pay for these shoes, they should be free. Okay. So yeah, they gave me these to protect the balls of my feet. Um, now we can get to unboxing. So this is a shoe. This is the box and this is the Luby girl. And I got these, um, you can see there i don't know if it will focus but these are the luby girl 100 millimeter and these are in the color nude and they are a napa leather and i got a size 40.5 which is a um a european 10 and a half my true u.s size is a 10 so with all christian louboutins for um their open toe shoes i just have to size up a half a size so here is the box. Now I'm going to take the lid off. And you just got all this paper here. And here is the shoes in the box. Now I wanted something cute and casual that I could just wear every day on the go with some jeans or with a nice um, dress, something not too fancy. So that was the purpose of these pair. And I will be purchasing these in black. And when I do, I'll make a video to show you guys. But let me take one out. Actually, I'm gonna just take both out. So here are the shoes. Oh, let me take the paper off, you guys. So here are the shoes. As you can see, they are a really pretty Napa leather. They are gorgeous. I got some paper or something stuck right there. I'll get that off later. Anyways, they're very gorgeous. They have a crisscross ankle. They actually crisscross in the back, and then you put them over your feet like that. And here's the bottom. Ooh. And this famous sticker right here that says, do not take these off until you know that you are keeping them on, sweetie. You see that? So I'm definitely going to be wearing these. And I know for a fact, I'm going to be keeping these. I have already tried them on, walked around in them, and they are comfortable enough for me. So I love these. I just wanted to do a quick video to show you guys these beautiful heels oh my gosh gorgeous and because i know y'all want to know because i know y'all want to know because i know you guys want to know 
And because I know you guys want to know, I have pulled out my receipt so I can show you guys how much I paid for these. So if it will focus, you will see right here that these were $898.43 US. I don't know if that will focus you guys. I don't think it will. I'm on my iPhone, so. But these were $825 and then with the tax, the tax was $73.43. So that bought them to $898.43. I wish you guys could see that, but if not, I'll just post the picture of the receipt for you guys in the video. But yeah, I really love these. I'm really happy with my purchase. Um, I will do another video on my Erezas because I really love those as well. And I have been trying to get the black Eriza suede for a very long time. And I finally found them in Saks, so I was able to get them. But I'm going to show you my shoe one more time. Here they are. So beautiful. So gorgeous. And here's the bottom. Oh, so pretty. I love these, you guys. I'm going to get some really good wear out of these. I'm not one of those people who like buy stuff and then doesn't wear it. I'm one of those people like when I buy something, I wear it down baby like i wear it down but i did buy some um soul protectors for these and i will be putting those on there and i'll actually make a video showing you guys how i protect the soles of these shoes because um, i used to own a pair of so kate sold them would not recommend very uncomfortable have those in black suede and i replaced those with the new eriza that i just got the eriza suede but um i will show you guys how i put the soul protector on the on there and I probably will insert some clips of me walking in these so you can see how they look on the feet. The only thing about buying these shoes was um, they didn't give me no dust bag. And I'm very, dust bags. And I'm very shocked by that because I got these in the store. And now that I think about it, now that I think about it, not only did they not give me dust bags for these, but they didn't give me any heel taps either. So now I'm wondering, like, should I go back to the store and see if they'll give me heel taps and a dust bag or dust bags? Do you guys think or do you think they'll think I'm playing? Well, I mean, I just bought these like they're clearly new, but I would like my heel taps. Like I thought that would be a standard thing, but I guess I wasn't um, paying too much attention, but. Yeah, you guys, I just wanted to show you show you these shoes. I'm going to show them to you one more time. One more time. There's the bottom. Here's the beautiful straps. That crisscross on the ankle. And you can see it has a very beautiful pitch. These are really good for me because I have flat feet. So it's not too high of an arch. Well, I have flexible fat, flat feet. So that means I have like a little bit of an arch. But there you go. You can't really tell, but they're the 40.5, just like I showed you. That beautiful, iconic red sole. I really love these. The nude Napa leather Luby Girl. Love these so much. And I will insert some clips of me walking in these so you can see how they look on the feet, you guys. Thanks for watching, and I hope you come back soon. Make sure to follow, like, share, and subscribe. Have a good day. Bye-bye.